Hello everyone, my name is Bianca Hoke and I am a Solutions Engineer here at Prefect. In this video, we will be reviewing how parameters are implemented in Prefect 1.0 and 2.0. Parameters are passed as arguments to our flow function and enable us to pass data to a flow that can change between use cases without having to adjust the flow itself. Parameters are available in both Prefect 1.0 and 2.0. In both cases, they can be used to set default values which are passed to the flow, as well as custom parameters which can be configured at runtime. In Prefect 1.0, parameters are implemented in our flow as specialized tasks. Let's take a look at this example of how parameters are used in 1.0. This is a very simple flow which adds 1 to the integer that is passed into the flow as an argument. Note how we are importing the parameter task at the start of the flow in order to use this feature. The default value for the parameter is set to 2, which is used whenever a value is not specified for the parameter. Before running this flow, let's take a look to see which version of Prefect we have installed in our environment. Now that we have confirmed we have Prefect 1.0 installed, let's run the code. The output shows the results of our task, which is adding 1 to the integers we passed into our parameter x. Now let's break our code for the sake of this demo. In this example, we have replaced the integers passed to our parameters with strings. Let's run this and see what happens. Notice that we are now receiving a type error. This can be remedied in Prefect 2.0 with parameter type conversion. This flow executes the same process as our 1.0 example, but it is more robust with how the parameters are handled. This is because Prefect 2.0 offers parameter type conversion, which enables Prefect flows and tasks to perform type conversion for the parameters passed to the flow function. Here we have specified in our flow that both X and Y should be coerced into integers. In this case, 42 is passed as a string and 100 is passed as an integer. Let's confirm we have Prefect 2.0 installed. And now we can see what happens when we run this flow. In this example, the flow does not fail despite being passed a string and the print plus one task is able to run successfully. We've reached the end of the demo. Thank you so much for watching and happy engineering.